dog parks can be a great way to socialize your dogs and teach them new tricks, but it is critical that you pick out the right park when you're introducing your puppy to a new dog park. There are a lot of elements to factor in before you take your little pooch into dog parks. In this video, we will dive deep into the basics of dog park protocols and how to introduce your pet to a dog park. But before we begin, we would like to share that Monku Dog has come up with a pet app where you can keep track of your dog's vaccination, make dog friends, find pet services, and helps you become a more responsible dog parent. Link to download is given in the description box below. Number 1. Assess and Evaluate Taking your pooch to the dog park is kind of similar to taking your kids to a preschool. That is why it is important that you personally evaluate the pros and cons of the dog park before you even take your dog there. You should also check for timings that are least crowded. Remember to pick the right dog park for your pet, not the first one. Number 2. Don't bring your dog to the dog park directly from home. That just means that you are bringing a frustrated or super excited dog to the park with other dogs that have been isolated at home for hours. This is what causes most dog fights. Walk them for 5 or 10 minutes and tire them out a little before bringing them to the dog park. Number 3. Ease your dog into being off leash. If your dog is not accustomed to being off the leash, you can try out different methods like keeping them off leash 20 to 30 minutes before entering the park or swap your regular leash for a longer one. Some dogs might feel intimidated while entering the dog park for the first time. So, be there with your dog and keep encouraging them to make friends. Number 4. Don't be afraid to bribe your dog with treats for good behavior. A little positive reinforcement never hurts anyone, but make sure to pick out the right treats and toys. It is always a good idea to carry your dog's favorite treats and toys to distract your dog in case they get aggressive at the dog park. Number 5. Make sure your dog makes friends. The whole point of a dog park is to get your dogs to socialize with one another and have a good time in each other's company. Now, there are a few things you should always try not to let happen in the dog park. Number 1. Pick up after your dog. This should go without saying, but a crucial part of dog park etiquette is to clean up after your pooch. Most parks have dedicated bins stocked with plastic bags, but it's best to carry your own baggie and scooper kit. Number 2. Dog Fight there is always a chance that your pooch may get into dog fights, in which case, if dogs are not releasing their grip on each other, then just hold the hind legs of your dog and lift them up. This way the dog will sense the loss of balance and will release the bite. Number 3. Leave at a sign of conflict. If you find any dog harassing your dog, or vice versa, leave the park immediately. This prevents the situation from escalating and prevents unwarranted accidents. That is all for this video folks. Do let us know if there is any other topics that we can cover for you in the comments below. And yes, don't forget to download our all new Monku Dog app. Link in the bio.